No, I'm going to make you do that now. What are you eating? Nothing. Again? Nothing. Nothing at all. Now, if you're planning a get together this Halloween or prepping for your little one party, Vince Wilson has the pick of this season's most fiendish food treats. And you can find details of all the products you're about to see by scanning the QR code that's on your screen now, which will take you to us three this morning. You might not see as many products as there were earlier on. Alice has been at them as well, by the way. It's not no. Japanese. <laughs> uh, can we just say uh, we're talking birthdays? Claire's yes. birthday. Thank you. Uh, Happy to you. Happy birthday for you this weekend. Yes, it was a big birthday. I thought I was. Happy birthday, Dad! With my mm-hmm. brother. And I turned up at an old barn in the middle of nowhere, and there was 150 people there from my life. My wife has. Secretly planned it all the way since February. That's amazing. It's unreal. It was the most amazing night. Oh, did you have fun? Oh, it was brilliant. It and we did like a sort of a This Is Your Life type event. Yes, it was. People from, all, you know, all different walks This of is life. the moment. Oh, what you got that? Everyone's in the barn. Oh, my Lord. Yeah, yeah. Oh, oh, I don't know what. Just Hold on. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Had you and your brother gone as the tea birds to the pub yeah. from Greece? <laughs> yeah, that's what's the rock of the vision. That's our band that we play. Of course it is. Amazing. Oh, oh, happy birthday. Thank you so much happy for showing Thank you, thank you, thank you. Amazing. <laughs> right, were well, uh, any of the snacks any good? Were they as good as this? Are we well, give you? I don't know, you come over here because okay. I said, we'll have, we'll have a Halloween party now. Yes, that's the cool. greater line. Oh. And this, I know. So listen, let's quickly begin by showing you what's available at Asda. Okay, yeah. down the front there, we've got a big bat shaped pizza, which is two quid. Which I think is really, yeah, really I'm cool. Go Very nice. Oh, oh, oh. And the giant cookie there, which is eight quid. Oh, oh. Yeah. Wow. So, oh. so many products. Mm. All the places. The supermarkets have gone wild this year. This, this is a uh, M&S. Okay. Mm-hmm. So yeah, like you say, look. That is Colin. Isn't it? Spooky Colin. The spooky, spooky Colin has got bones along his back. He's basically like a giant skeleton, and inside it's filled with uh, blood red buttercream. No, it's not. <laughs> oh, 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 it's so quick. Uh, 12 quid for uh, Colin. That's well, you've got to take that home now. <laughs> no one else can have that. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah, and then let's start licking. <laughs> yeah. How about this flatbread? Look, I'm going to, there's some slices there for you all the time, but this is a very, very garlicky flatbread. But it's just a good taste. It's one of those things that gives you my fridge on, very, on days when I need more help. That's hardcore garlic. It's really strong in there. I think I look like a space raider, Chris. Yeah, you do, you do. Very nice. Love that. That's £4.50. All typical fantasy is a jelly there. That's a bat-shaped jelly, which is just, and it's like a mixture. Part of like a three for 12 quid deal. They're really, really lovely. Let's move on to Sainsbury's now. They've got tray bakes here. Tray bakes have been around ever since like World War II era was when they started, but the the tray wasn't coined until 1980 in the UK, believe it or not. This is a really lovely. Chocolate, uh, almost like a brownie, but it's a co- chocolate sponge. Really yeah. tasty. Mm-hmm. It's about seven quid. It's useful as well if you're having kids over and you don't know how many kids you're having. Yeah, you can cool. slice it Absolutely. depending. Yeah, definitely. And also, they, they're doing some crisps this year, which are, is that one there? That's that shape. Can you see that? Oh, no, it's they You just ate it. So I love oh, the fact they don't come out of the uniform, but they're bat shaped crisps. And they right? do little like, ideas of cobweb shapes as well. Like worm shapes? You don't really care. Uh, do you know? <laughs> <laughs> it's a tasty thing. Mm, no, it's a tasty thing. One pound, one pound fifty a pack. Oh, I like that. Love it. So um, now co-op. So they're doing some really Ooh. cute um buns. So mm. this, this is a chocolate brownie, but it's got a it's got a tangy apple frosting on the on the top. Oh, mm. Yes, yeah, yeah. That's well, 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 Yeah, yeah. So we've got here. These are. Is this a sausage roll? Yeah. So this is called a mummy dog. 
So it's because it's got two little eyes. You can see that on there? Two little eyes on there, wrapped up like a mummy. It's basically a cotton roll. I mean, it's quite it's quite weak in terms of the mummy thing. But I'm sure it's two. Got two eyes on it. Cat, what boy you want? Two eyes on it. <laughs> I'm very distracted by the meat fist. So, yeah, this is cool. So. Uh, well, know, when you monster. say it's cool, I monster. think my kids would love it, but I'm not a monster hand. Monster hand, monster hand. Monster hand. <laughs> monster hand. Monster hand. Monster hand. It's a separate thing. It's smoke bacon written on the top. It is. What's your butt? That's it. Right. Just when I'm done, that couldn't be any less appealing. You call it a meat <laughs> bar. By the way, by the way, <laughs> my boys would be straight in at that without even holding it. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. And they wouldn't even put it in the bun. It'd be like straight no. in. Just give me the meat days. Three ninety nine for each them, but uh, honestly, the the range of stuff they have is outstanding. Mm. So much. Um, over to this one, finally, yeah. over here. So sweets, I need to show you some sweets. So yeah, Haribo, for him. Haribo have made some really cute um, skeleton gummies. Yeah. Haribo, yeah. Haribo invented the gummy sweet in nineteen twenty six. Yeah. So taking credit for it is literally that. Yeah, that, that, was, that. that was the gummy bear, the gold bear, as we know now. So that was so long ago, but they, they're really, really nice flavors, really well cool. tasty. And also we've got um, the Swizzle. Swizzle's been around forever, mm. like 1928 they started. In 2012 they did the Squashies, and these are skeleton, or Swelletons in fact they call them. <laughs> and they, what they did is they made gummies, sort of soft, sweet, flavored like their traditional ones, the refreshers, drumsticks, love hearts. You're having a lovely time, aren't you? And they're really good, aren't they? Really the ones keep coming over and nipping. Yeah, they are. There they? was a, definitely another full bowl of those. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So £1.35, £1.50 respectively for them. Oreos, mm -hmm. what they've done for Halloween is they, they're, they're, they're the cream vanilla centre in that orange, of course. Oh, great. The traditional pattern on the top is now replaced by pumpkins and cobwebs. Lovely. And that kind of thing. They're really, really lovely. Uh, £1.50 a pack. And then finally, Mr. Kipling, launched in 1957. Exceedingly good Extremely. And what, it, it, the French fancies were part of the initial launch of that brand, and now they've got them in orange, and they're called English fancy for Halloween. So it's that like just for Halloween they've got orange, just for Halloween. That's amazing. They'll they be see... back to sherbet colours this time. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> it's just, it's just, it's just, it's some amazing, amazing. Thank you. Thank you. So much. Thank you. You rattled through. Thank you so much. Thank you. Yeah. 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 Right, the loose women are here next on ITV. Hello, Hello there. Cat, enjoy the rest of your birthday. Thank, Thank you, you darling so heart. Thank you. So coming up on loose women with more questions, Rick. Thank you, darling heart. Thank you. So coming up on this sort of well, it's about loose and let's move to the conviction. We featured two journalists who had unprecedented access to the case, their thoughts taken. Also, here's Big Sound after the Strictly Report, should Giovanni Panice return to the show. And continuing their royal tour are the King and Queen, the best example of Britain's support the end of And I'll see you in my room. Bye bye. Bye bye. See you bye bye. Sorry, Gina de Campo. Bye bye. I'm Georgina. See you in my room on Miss Moyer. And tomorrow, the rest of the day for very funny. Good morning, Georgina, with a fabulous Miss Howard. Ciao, 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 ciao,